What makes life worth living in a public space is culture. In my hierarchy of values, culture comes before politics. I believe the votes in France and the Netherlands do not mean a no to Europe. I believe we have to take seriously the concerns expressed in those votes. As Democrats, we have a duty to do so. There are some problems of democracy or transparency or accountability. Let's look at it. But at the same time, responsible leaders have to think if they want to be led by public opinion or if they have the courage to lead the public opinion in terms of showing what is the best way for Europe. If we want to keep, preserve and reinforce our values, we have to modernize our policies and progressively we are building a common agenda to achieve results. And it is a Europe of results, a Europe that European citizens show that is delivering on growth, also on a common purpose, and this requires a lot of efforts in terms of responsible leadership. For, for all of this we need confidence. I think there is a confidence problem. The way we look at ourselves and the way in which culturally we look now at the world the way we face the challenges of the beginning of the 21st century. We have to think, is globalization going away or is globalization going to be there for the next years? It's not a political decision. No country really, even the most powerful countries, they do not control this process. To a large extent it is driven by technological change. So in face of it, we have two possibilities. Are we going to hide? Are we going to pretend that it does not exist? Are we going to resist it? Or are we going to try to manage it with our values, the European values, the European way of life? European citizens are not asking for less Europe. It depends. In some areas, yes, they want to feel the protection of the member state. They want to not to to see at risk their social security systems. They want to feel their community, their identity. But they are asking us more common action in foreign, action, in foreign affairs. And so I believe there is a future for Europe. The globalization will be a driving force for our coherence. Thank you for your attention. <laughs>